Well, the only thing we know for certain, 100% certain, that fiat money will continue to debase. The question is, what assets do you need exposure to to protect yourself against that certainty? Let's just play a game. If there's $900 trillion of total global assets. If Bitcoin gets 100 trillion of those 900 trillion, which is one ninth, it's a slightly above 10%. What is 100 trillion divided by 21 million? Oh, that's now sort of interesting because all of a sudden, it's $5 million US per Bitcoin in today's dollars. Giddy up, people. We're worried about the next $5,000 move in Bitcoin, and we have a model here that says it should be $5 million. This is where people need to understand why you have to have exposure to this asymmetric return opportunity.